Is today shaping up to be one of those days? No need to stress because even if your day is going down the drain, it's probably still better than the kind of day these poor souls are having. So there was this smart dude who said, if it doesn't fit, don't push it. So there's this other dude who keeps getting nagged by his boss to tie down his stuff. He's like, yeah, yeah, whatever. But man, does he regret it now. Dude, seriously, save yourself the pain and ring up a locksmith. I used to work their butt outs for that. Then one clumsy O comes along and boom! Gone in a flash. Poof. Sometimes you just gotta admit that a backpack is just way smarter than a purse. This is one of those times, trust me. This crazy corny move was supposed to be epic, but ended up going viral for all the wrong reasons. Gents, this ain't the way you sleep ladies off their feet. Guy's been working too hard, he deserves a break. Not this kind of break though. <laughs> The warranty definitely ain't gonna cover this. What did you do? Michael, what did you do? So, seatbelts are all like, I'm here to keep you safe, man. But then there are some that are like, and bite you. Crazy, right? Lift up, lift up that side. Lift it fast, fast, fast. Are you serious? What's wrong with you? You're such a mess. <laughs> Gently, gently, ah, oh, what the f <laughs> Looks like he traded the muddy mess for broken sandals. But hey, we can close her a win. I owed him up. <laughs> Maybe next time you should invest in some rain boots and avoid the whole dilemma. Yes, <laughs> you This pressure washer is giving that man a run for his money. Actually looks more like he's trying to rein in a wild stallion. Well, that's one way to get out of a workout. Guess we can add falling off the pull-up bar to the list of valid excuses for skipping exercise. Looks like someone forgot to update their glass door detection software. You know that one person who tries super hard to not mess up but still ends up with an epic fail? Yeah, that's her. Looks like the mailman just got a special delivery. A front row seat in someone's yard. Hope he remembered to stab himself fragile before taking that tumble. Now that's one way to avoid dealing with a problem. Just pretend it didn't happen and look the other way. Too bad the broken glass won't magically fix itself with that strategy. Guess this guy wanted to capture every moment of his parasailing adventure. Even the part where he donates his phone to the sea. That boy's got some serious dedication to taking out the trash. Too bad the wind keeps slapping him in the face of the lid. Maybe you should call for backup? Something tells me he's gonna hit those high notes no problem after this. If she had just noticed the gate literally beside her, she'd have been spared from the embarrassment. Are these guys had no clue how heavy that rock was, so they thought their truck was the Hulk. There you go. Jesus Christ! 
Looks like that guy took bike into the next level way too seriously. How many people do you need to fill a water dispenser? Three if you base it on this clip. But how many does it take to destroy one? Just this guy. That's efficiency. Ah, oh, sure, let's use sticks to support his weight. What could possibly go wrong? Not like they'll snap like twigs or anything. Looks like that guy's motorbike has a mind of its own, but unfortunately, not a very bright one. Yeah, that's one way to make a ping pong sandwich. Hope we didn't forget the mayo. This is what you call a perfect combo of bad luck and bad timing. Next time our biker friend should consider adding a snorkel to his gear just in case. If it's a windy day, just eat indoors. This guy forgot that he was the one holding the cake. Genius. Looks like he overestimated his beer carrying abilities and underestimated the power of gravity as well. Better stick to carrying one tray at a time. Trust me, better ways to open a bottle of champagne. <laughs> well, it looks like someone's monkeying around with the birthday festivities. Let's be real, who wouldn't want to steal a cake? That monkey's got good taste. These guys are in quite a tricky predicament here, but tipping it sideways really was not the best idea, guys. This guy's pain is fully realized and he is no handyman. Well, I guess that table was just like a fragile ego. Couldn't handle even the slightest tap without shattering into a million pieces. Eh, ah, hashtag rest in peace table. Oh, what's even funnier here? The fact that there was a perfectly level countertop just beside her that she could have used. Looks like our gallant fireman here skipped the day when they were teaching how to handle fire hydrants in fireman training camp. What is it? Hey, I may I'm not When you're ready to kick someone's behind, but then you slowly realize it was you who effed up. Whoa, 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 ma'am! No, ma'am, ma'am, no, wait, hold on, ma'am. No, no, hey, just, hey, listen, just, hey, listen, no, no, I'm just trying to help, hold on, hold on, ma'am, tonight. There's only a one way, I can't go any faster, I'm trying to find a okay. parking space. Okay, okay, your purse is on the top of your car, I just was trying to let you know so you didn't, you know, lose anything. Sir. She should have taken a page from the biker's book and tested the waters before she went in. 
He doesn't seem to mind being all wet, though. Before you try jumping a six-foot gap yourself, just remember, like this guy, you're not as athletic as you think. Looks like someone won't be winning any Mechanic of the Year awards there, Pally. Maybe next time you should stick to fixing things that don't involve flammable materials. Well, that's one way to make a champagne shower for your guests without even trying. Talk about a party trick that's both impressive and messy at the same time. Fixing a garage door window, probably a hundred or so dollars, really. The face on this father and daughter duo, absolutely priceless though. Some pillars are made to be tough and structural. Some are merely for decoration. Guess what this pillar is. Big and leaning on things, this guy thought it was a bright idea to lean his ladder on this lamppost. The post was not a fan of his bright idea. Ah, uh, old disappearing fur parent trick. Always good for a laugh. But in this case, mommy was the butt of the joke. <laughs> Every school has this kind of teacher. You know what I'm talking about. Those cool teachers that do things to make sure their students are entertained while learning stuff. Well, this guy taught his lesson in a very painful way. I hope this guy wasn't seriously injured while making this literally smashing entrance. Winning in any kind of sport requires focus and dedication. When your sport is biking, make sure to focus on the road as well. Not really sure what he was trying to do, but if he was aiming for the perfect face plant, I'd give this a 10 out of 10. They say pets always show unconditional love to their owners. Well, clearly not all of them are the same. Yeah, girl, those are some sick dance moves. But honestly, that move in the end. Did you do that on purpose? I split though. <laughs> that was so close. In any case, I'll never trust a guy wearing a Santa hat to catch me ever again. <laughs> See you all next time. <laughs>